Buckeye basketball breaks even in conference with two clutch road wins over Wisconsin and Iowa. Ohio State traveled to Madison and knocked off the number 14 Wisconsin Badgers in a thrilling 59-58 victory. The Buckeyes took the lead late in the game with a minute and 36 seconds left. All of Aaron Kraft's seven points came in the last four minutes of the game. The high-pressure Buckeye defense kept the Badgers from scoring in the last six and a half minutes in the game, which ultimately came down to the final shot, but the Badgers couldn't get it done. The Buckeyes continued on the road, taking on Iowa. Aaron Kraft led the Buckeyes to a victory with 17 points, 6 steals, and 6 assists. Revenge rang sweet when the Buckeyes took the game 76-69. to They are set to take on Purdue this weekend at the shot. Coming off a 90-64 win over Illinois at home last week, the women's basketball team also traveled to Wisconsin to take on the Badgers. But unlike the men's team, the women couldn't quite get it done, losing 82-71. to The Buckeyes trailed by as many as 22 points in the second half. They managed to cut the lead to seven at one point with the help from Raven Ferguson as she tallied 17 points in the game, but couldn't overcome the deficit. In men's hockey, the Buckeyes were able to sweep the series against Penn State taking the first game 5-1 and the second game 5-2. Max McCormick and Ryan Dezingle each had two goals in the first game and one in the second. Freshman goalie Christian Frey managed a whopping 46 saves in the first game. These nodes landed Dezingle and Frey Big Ten Stars of the Week. The Buckeyes traveled to East Lansing for a weekend series against Michigan State. In wrestling, the number 12 Ohio State faced off against rivals number 11 Michigan. The Buckeyes were down 6-0 early, but managed to rally back and close the deficit 9-7 thanks to sophomore Mark Martin's victory. But in the end, couldn't overcome the Wolverines, losing 21-12. The Buckeyes were able to turn it around in West Lafayette, defeating Purdue in a close 16-15 victory. The Buckeyes will take on Michigan State on Friday. Men's tennis has started off their season on the right foot with a 7-0 overall record, defeating Youngstown State and Wright State this past weekend 4-0. They'll continue their season this weekend at home against Kentucky. Men's volleyball coming off a hot four-game winning streak were stopped in Chicago by Loyola, losing to the number one ranked team 3-0. In the loss, Michael Henchy had 10 kills for the Buckeyes. For all your winter and spring sports news, make sure to check out thelantern.com and follow Lantern Sports on Twitter. Reporting for The Lantern, I'm Jordan Elwood.